Huzzah's little Dalaborn here, and welcome to SAP Cater, a very positive game that F millions of people are playing and are enjoying it 100%. All positive reviews, all the wonderful comments and concerns, everyone just getting it there. It's a wonderful game, a top 10 tier. Tomatoes love it, and the audience love it. President Obama plays it, and even though he's not the president anymore, it's amazing. It's a wonderful game. So here's what we'll do. Let's see. A little patch and I just say, because so much for friends of shame, but it's very okay. So now we're gonna go, we're gonna play a breach, host this video, or join us in D class. We're gonna join us in D class, so let's go ahead and see the servers. Hmm. I must be having internet issues, let's refresh. Hmm. Yeah, let's try this again. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I see. Okay. Alright. Alright. Yep. Mm hmm. I understand. Ah, I see. Yes. Mm hmm. Alright. So, I think uh, we can't actually be a D class in here, and so here's what we'll do we'll go post as an SAP so that way the millions of people could actually join us and play it. So, let's see. We're gonna have see. We got site, storage, bio, site. Uh, let's go for. Uh, the storage or site. Well, let's go for site. That's that's what we'll do. We'll click on site. And now let's find some players. Now we have a few choices while we're actually waiting. We have like you know we gotta have five. Stuff. So we could play as SCP uh, Shy Guy. We could play uh, the SCP of the Lake Doctor. We could play as the Old Man or an interesting ph phenomenon, 80811, also known as the Swamp Lady, who was actually, you know, the first time seeing her as playing again. So let's go ahead and see, pick our characters. You know what? I'm going to be uh, the Plague Doctor because he's awesome. And let's go ahead and play. Now we just we have to wait for some D class to join us. And we'll actually have the time of lives of actually hunting them down and seeing the terrors from their eyes. God, any second now they're gonna actually show up. Mm, it's gonna be so terrifying for them. They think it's going to be safe, but no. Real terror. Real terror. I say it's going to be really big. It's going to be big. It's going to be awesome. Now that I think about it, while we're waiting for all the hot millions of players to actually join me, I think I'm going to actually try Old Man, because he is actually one of the most terrifying things ever. So yeah, we're gonna actually play as the old man going through walls and getting them. <laughs> Someone's gonna join. Someone's gonna join and it's gonna be fun. So much fun. I'm gonna actually see them see scared of terror daylight out of them. It's gonna be terrifying. So gonna be fun. I wonder what type of people I'm going to encounter. People that curse, maybe some 10 year olds, who knows. It's going to be a fun, fun, fun. And they're going to actually try to see if they can actually beat me. While we're waiting, I'm thinking what would be other characters that they can add later on. I'm thinking uh, SCP-173. You know, the statue that doesn't move unless you blink. They should add the blinking mechanics. Maybe give him an ultimate ability where he can actually spawn fake duplicates because it is in theory that a 173 can actually reproduce, despite not knowing how in the world that happened. Almost caused an end of the world scenario, I'll say that much.
one of the things I think they should actually do is make a battle pass, you know, a battle pass where they actually could get all this wonderful cosmetics that they would obviously do when they're actually playing this awesome, amazing 10 out of 10 game. For example, we could have maybe Shy Guy do a little dance, maybe the uh, do a little dabbing from the uh, Plague Doctor, and also have the D class actually say, have their own dialogue or something like that. Oh, give them col colorful clothing and wear red, blue, green, polka dotted, and maybe all the trend, you know, the gender those flags. Oh yeah, everyone would love that. Now that time has passed, I think I could actually decide that I want to play as SCP-811. Yeah, we could play as SCP-811, where we could play the Swamp Woman. And you know what, there could be so much memes with her, we could call, we'll call her Kermit the Frog's wife, or maybe Shrek's Fiona. Yeah, that would be awesome. Everyone would actually make so much jokes with that. we say, hey, this is my girlfriend type of memes with the glasses. Well, yeah, that would be fun, especially if we have proximity chat for both moms and the humans to hear each other. Yep, this is a quality game that everyone actually should love to play. I heard that they were actually going to plan on adding a 682 on this east part of the map. They made it much more smaller and hairier. Uh, then his or whatever he could actually be, but then again, he has the ability to actually change his size at will. But that might actually be difficult. Although then again, if uh, if they don't actually add 682, at least there's like a 682 game out there where you, you know it's free to play. You go and try to contain 682 while he hunts you down and eats you. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. I'm so excited to actually play this game. I swear, it's going to be fantastic. It's like the fantasy I always wanted. It's like Death, death by Daylight, but with SCPs. And you know what? It's going to be fun. It's special how millions of people are actually enjoying it. Even, their mo even mothers are actually playing it with their kids and saying that they approve this game because it's actually very scientific and very thermonable and actually helps people grow. It's wonderful. You know, I think, I think I actually changed my mind on something. I think I don't want to play as the Swamp Woman as much as I would love to make Kirby D. Frog jokes with that voice. I think I'm going to play my good old best friend that I love to play as during the Gary's Mods oops, SCP RP series, SCP-096. Hello, I don't do that. Voice when I'm really so happy, but then crying, and then get angry, and then start ripping them apart like they should definitely do in this game, and definitely not having them actually be just knocked by a slap in the hand. They'd be insta kill, and yeah, that's how it goes. SCP 096 is not one to trend with, especially if you've already seen his face. You're dead, they're all dead. I'll win the game, it'll be easy peasy, lemon squeezy. <sighs> You know, in one parallel universe, uh, a scientist who was destined to try to kill the shy guy actually thought of a plan of actually having a D-class look at a picture while heading towards the sun. And then the, D and then the SCP-096 miraculously takes one super jump from Earth, going right to the D-class and then getting engulfed by the sun, assuming that he was actually dead. Then the he was terminated because he was actually had no more usefulness of him. And, you know, they test the theory, having the picture of Shy Guy, and nothing happened, and everyone was okay. Except for the part where the sun was actually getting closer and closer to, to the Earth. Meaning, I think the sun became Shy SCP-096. An interesting phenomenon, huh? I've been actually thinking of making like a Pokemon Rumble style Minecraft mod with all the SCPs. And I mean like little figurine SCPs that walk around on the land, matching the shape and size and descriptions from every single file, but do it in order. And I think it might be too much for me to do, but if I could, I could make it at least like 1000 per mod. Let's make it like a bundle, you can just imagine. Like from 
SCP-001, actually, no, I think I'll keep 001 separate because there's, like, a couple of those that are actually wrapping themselves. So, 002, all the way to 1000. So, basically, the living room. Was it the living room? I think it was the living room. The living room, all the way to Bigfoot. Just these little, mi little Minecraft characters roaming around on Earth. I mean, they won't have their special effects like the actual SCP uh, Minecraft mod that's out there, but, you know, something cute and adorable or something like that. I'm really excited about this game. I really am. I can't wait to play. You know what? One of the things they could do is actually open a skin shop. Yeah. So that way you could play as other characters or modded. Yes, let's add a workshop in this where we can actually have, I don't know, so replace Zero... Uh, for nine as a Yandere. Yeah, a Yandere simulator. Or even actually make the SCP-106 people can mod him to look like the original uh, Shy Guy f version of himself from the original SCP Containment Bridge game. Yeah, that would actually be really cool. And you know, if you want to, if anyone want to, someone could actually put some clothes, a well-dressed man for Shy Guy. Oh yeah, that would be wonderful. I really, really want to scream a lot, but I'm also actually talking really, really quiet and right near or up the mic because, you know, everyone's sleeping in the background and didn't have to make it dark, so that way it's much more scary while I actually play this game and make it terrifying for everyone else. It's gonna be amazing. You know, if this game actually becomes much more phenomenal or amazing and whatnot, they should actually put it on the Xbox. And maybe also on the PlayStation and possibly on Nintendo. They should actually do that. This game is phenomenal. Uh, the suspense of it is going to be, the wait is going to be worth it, I tell you. As soon as, as soon as the uh, millions of people actually get on, they are going to have so much fun. You know, there's like a group of SCPs that are actually called like Mr. and Mrs. And if you collect them all, you become Mr. Collector. It's quite interesting. A little bit difficult though, because there's like some certain SCPs that would actually affect some humans. For example, uh, there's like this Miss Lucky or Miss Beauty or this pink girl. I forgot what her name is. I forgot her number is. <laughs> she she name my number. Well, anywho, she apparently had likes to eat candy, Miss Candy, I think it was, Miss, Miss Sugar, I don't know, but she likes to eat candy a lot, it gives her power also, and also apparently if men actually eat candy or they're too close to her, they turn into candy unicorns or candy men, I don't know, well, all I know is women only actually guard her, so, that's, yeah, I do like Mr. Fish though, he's a swell guy. <coughs> You know what, I changed my mind. I, I've actually had my doubts, but I think the first pick that I had for SCP-049 was the best choice. I mean, he touches people and they instantly die. He's amazing. Although, if I to be frank, if they actually plan on adding another person, they should actually put the mask in this game. Yes, SCP-053. He's zombified, you know, court goes around making technicals and he's like possessing a body that's dripping goop. That would be amazing. Yep. I'm really excited I'm playing this game. Just need the billions of D class to actually join so we can actually start the match. You know, speaking of 002, I bet it would be fun to play as the living room. All you have to do is lure people inside here and then turn them into furniture. All their bones, all their organs, all their brains and spleens, all their intestines, everything, turn into furniture. You see that TV? Made of human teeth. That's what you're watching. A very colorful teeth V show. Get it? <laughs> uh, yeah, that was that was a good one, Pat. That was a good one, so thank you, Zill. Do you think they'll actually add if we, if we do have battle passes and a skin shop, you think that we can also have pets? Just imagine we can have 
All the little I see, the little one, little guys with the eyes. We can have a tickle monster. Just imagine, just little little guys following us around while we actually do our tasks as D class. That would be amazing. You know, the one thing I actually have a problem with this game is practice. It would be great if we have like a testing against AI so that way we can actually test our skills and learn how to play these characters so that way it's much more easier to actually handle it later on in the future, especially while we're waiting for all the billions of players who are actually playing this game. actually take care of something real quick it was you know my business and that's all i had to do i'm back and it looks like we're still waiting but that's all right we're still waiting there's many people who are actually trying to decide whether to choose it could be because my name is zill so i could be the last name in the uh uh lobby search so that could be the reason why everyone hasn't actually picked me but that's okay i could i'm a patient person i mean it's a whole alphabet from a to z so it's gonna it takes some time You know, this game actually is like a very inspirational for everyone. I bet in the future we will have an SCP Battle Royale game. Just imagine it. A whole island with like a facility, fences everywhere, and then D classes, hundreds of D classes falling out of a, mm, a, a plane or, so let's see, maybe there's like, there's like a SCP spaceship. I think there is. Yeah, and have everyone fall out of there, and they all land, and they try to get into the circle of the of the storm. Meanwhile, a, a group of SCPs spawn everywhere in the world, and they try to hunt everyone down. And the last day, Clay's laugh, a laugh, is the winner. Anyone that sees Shy Guy's face, they die. Uh, if they get glued close to the uh, Black Doctor and he kills them, they die. Uh, SCP-811, the Swamp Woman in the swamps, you know, she die. And even, even the statue, oh, possibly maybe in the final round while there's 10 people left, uh, SCP-682 will come out and will actually spawn and he'll actually head straight towards the, cent the circle from the storm. Well, oh, that would be amazing. All the battle passes, all the skins and, you know, little pets that you can have and the emotes that I actually mentioned earlier. All oh, that would be great. Come on, everyone. Come on, community. We have a community of SCP in the Steam section of our any game for them on Nintendo, PlayStation, Xbox, I don't care, on the PC. We need to make this happen. An SCP Battle Royale game. Just imagine the potentials. All the, even the D-Class could actually dress up as some of the SCPs. I mean, it's easier for the Pike Doctor, but imagine like wearing a mask of Shy Guy or something like that. It would be amazing. Just imagine the potentials here. The bill, a billionaire credit. No, no credit. It, just a little bit of credit, and I don't need any money. Just make this a dream come true. That would be amazing. Alright, um, I just realized that I actually have no more space on my computer for any more recording, so unfortunately I guess we'll have to actually stop here for now, so we unfortunately will have to get back to this another time, so don't worry, we'll actually, yeah, we'll just have to leave for now, as again, we'll drive, we'll face all the amazing, we'll enjoy the amazing content in the future, until then, Thank you all so much for ever watching. I hope you actually enjoy this wonderful experience of this game of SCP Keeter. It's an amazing game, top 10, and I hope you actually try it yourself. Until then, I'm Zittle Talborn, and I'll be seeing you, and you'll be seeing me next time. See ya!